Good morning, everybody. Good morning, Nigerians. This is Dr. Ambassador Victoria Enojobo, the unbeatable, the voice that cries in the wilderness. Appreciating God for making us to be alive. God is seriously taking us speedily this year to see all to his, see his goodness and we shall all see the end of the year. I am making this voice note. This is a national president of the National Widows Forum, a voice that speaks from the wilderness. I speak when I am anointed to speak. I speak when God permits me to speak. And I want to make this voice note, addressing it. I am addressing this voice note specifically to gain what a man and all grand pressure group. I am addressing this voice note specifically, very brief, direct to the point to gain what a man and the all grand pressure group. I want to let these two group of people to know that they have suffered Nigerians enough. They have dribbled Nigerians enough. They have done things against Nigerians enough. It has come to when you need to tell Nigerians nothing but the truth. I want to call all Grand Treasure Group from the presidency down to the last member. You came out, you made a mistake. I want to re remind you how Nigerians love you, backing you up financially and the other ways that as I'm talking now. You know that I'm the president of the National Widows Forum. And widows, National Widows Forum members are everywhere. In about everywhere. I can, as I'm talking now, I can tell you what any of you has. What any of you, any property, whether car, whether house, that any of you, some of you have bought. I can tell you that. But I'm not going there. Because if you're working, you can eat. But the, the, the sad side of it is if you are not working, if you are deceiving the people that are giving you that money. I want to call all grand pressure group to come out and tell Nigerians the complete truth. You only told them half truth by making them to know that Ken Wakama has no money. But you now went and pinned them again by assuring them that you are giving them money. Whereas you know that there is no money you are giving to them. All this thanking Tinubi that doesn't know what is happening. Tinubu does not hear your voice. You have nothing to do with all this coming out to thank uh, Amen Tinubu and thank this and thank it. Why you know that it is not true? Anything that Tinubu is doing is doing it for general Nigerians. It's not giving you people any special money to give to, to register those that registered for UAG, UAG. Anything Tinubu is doing, like now, every Nigerian that has access is registering for 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 for, for loan. Nigeria, Nigerian government is giving us loan to every Nigeria that registered and the, your registration is successful, you will receive loan of from one million up. That one is government operations. It is not for it is not for UAG registered members. It's not for UAG CEOs. So all this uh, coming out to give voice note and be thanking our men, the Tinubu that doesn't know you, that doesn't even know that you exist. Can you people stop it? Fellow Nigerians, government is giving out loans. Now, people are registering. If you are, if you are lucky and you registered, and you registered for government loan, 
when government will begin to give out loan, you will get from one million up and you will pay back. That is what Nigerian government is doing, and they are not doing it through uh, anybody. They are not doing it uh, to uh, registered UAG uh, registered members or CEO. It is just purely government operations. They don't know. They don't know anybody. They don't know anybody. If you read, if you register, you register. You they have enumerators. If you are connected to enumerators and you register, and your name scans through, you will receive the loan. I and and my widow solemn, we are we are monk. We registered because God connected us with some enumerators, government enumerators. So, members of Widow Sorum, we registered. When they will start giving out the money, if your name scares through, you will get the loan. It is not subject to uh, the UAAG. Nobody knows anything about UAAG. Nobody knows all these ones that you people are coming to deceive people. Please, lose these people, let them rest. Lose them, let them rest. It is a pure truth. Come and tell them instead of all this lie. Tomorrow is another thing, another day is another thing. Come and the president of uh, all grand pressure group. Come out and tell Nigerians the whole truth. Tell them that this episode of UAG of them getting money that is it is it is fallacy. Make them know that they are not getting any money. Make it open to them. If since you people came out to tell them about Ken, that you people made it open that there is no money anywhere, these Nigerians would have gone to rest. They would have come back to their various works. But you are still hyping them. You are still giving them hope against all hopes. You are still, still giving them hope that has no value, hope that has no end. End it for them. Tell them the truth. You are there. They made you a leader. They made you their leaders. Tell them the truth. A leader leads his people to, to great fortunes, to virtues. Stop leading them to blindness. Stop leading them blindly. Stop pushing them to where there is no hope. If you are if you are if you are still in grand community and you're expecting that government is sending anything palliative, anything money to you, you are making no, you are disturbing your health. Go back. There is no money in grand community. There is no money there. Also, Ken Makama. Has it not come when you can come out and tell Nigerians the truth, tell them there is nothing instead of all these lies? Come out and tell them there is nothing. Then apologize to Nigerians and now bring out the remaining money. I know you have spent almost all the money buying property, you sending your children abroad, you do one thing or the other, but some money still remains. Bring out that money instead of looking for who you will bribe. Because I, we know what you people have been doing. Since this woman, uh, Temi Tope, since she went to uh, 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 to verify you people, I know the type of money that you people have been wasting to see how you people can bribe to make her journey useless. But she, God is using her to overpower you people. Because those people, you, are, you people are giving money. They will collect money, but they will still say the truth. So instead of wasting that money, Ken Wakama, we know all the places we have been going to. We know your boys that you have sent to different places to go and bribe, to go and make way. Your lawyers who have sent here and there to go and bribe, but it's not working. They will collect money from you, but they will still say the truth too. Because the cries of this, of Temi uh, Tope and the people that are working with her, their cries are so strong before God. So anything you people are doing, the truth will come and do. The truth will come out that you don't have anything, Ken Wakama, and by that time it will be dangerously dangerous. It is better before they, they, they bring out that, that truth, it's better you come out. You come out and apologize to Nigerians and start refunding them more. Call the CEOs for meeting. Tell them the whole thing. Very simple thing. It's pride and arrogance that is disturbing you, that are disturbing you. If not, call for a CEO's meeting, either online or physical meeting. 
Tell them the whole truth. Apologize to them. Now tell them how much that is remaining. And refund them that money so that you can have your peace. Ken Wakama. Ken Wakama, you can have your peace. This is Evangelist Dr. Ambassador Victoria Enojobo. I have been calling you, telling you this since last year. And people, the supporters club, we are supporting you. Now they have run away from they have run away from you. The remaining ones will soon run. Because that report will come out that it is empty, that, that everything happening since has been scammed. Where will you run to? Nigerians will come after you. It's better before the report comes and stop all those who have bribery. They cannot work this time. Stop it. Whatever Denis uh, Baloka is doing, she's not the one doing it. The, the Spirit of God is using her. She's not the one doing it. That's why any office she enters, she will find favor to enter the end. She, 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 she's not the one doing it. It is God working. So come out and apologize and stop suffering that woman. Stop suffering their fam her family members. Stop suffering them. The young guy, the young guy, uh, uh, the, the young men, Mr. Flip and the and the uh, Demi, Demi and the the the, 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 the worried prince. They, 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 they have been working and spending tirelessly. Some of us are thinking that they're quiet. They're not quiet. They're working. You are just suffering everybody, Ken Wakaba. Why not come and tell them the truth? Let all these hassle stop. Nobody will kill you because nobody, nobody is a saint. The Bible says, all have sinned and fallen short of the glory of God. But when we ask for forgiveness, that God is faithful and just to forgive us and cleanse us from all our unrighteousness. And you were preacher yesterday, I know you went to church now. Can one come out and tell Nigerian that there's no shishi? That everything is calm. Apologize to them. Do meeting with your CEO. Apologize to them. And tell them how much that is remaining. Bring it up. Instead of all these people you are bribing and wasting Nigerian money, can one let the tears of Nigerians touch you? Instead of wasting it and sending your boys here and there to go and bribe this, bribe that, as you are bribing it, God is knocking it out. It will not work. If bribe would have worked for you, can one it would have worked six. You know how you have bribe and bribe to get documents for your name to be there. You don't bribe, bribe, they spend money, 15 million, 5 million, 10 million, 20 million, 25 million. They'll be collecting it and they're laughing at you. It has not worked. If bribe would have worked, it would have worked for you. It is not everywhere. When God has risen up to set his people free, bribe doesn't work again. They will collect money from you, but they will still say the truth because God has possessed all of them to, to say the truth. You know that the report that will come out with this will be so bad, Ken Wakama. The report that, please let the voice not get to the all grand pressure group and Ken Wakama. I say the truth and nothing but the truth. There are people that have ego eyes. There are people that that are everywhere, in everywhere. I am the president of National Widows Room. Widows Room is everywhere. Widows Room is connected everywhere. So we know what is happening. There is no money anywhere. There is no money that any new people are giving to anybody. There is no money that uh, Grand Pressure Group is giving to you Nigerians. There is no money that Ken Wakama is giving to you Nigerians. Everything has ended. Stop hoping against all hope. Stop that. Advise yourself and go your way. Advise yourself and go your way. You have been scammed. That is not the end of life. If some of you had listened to us last year, it would have been better. You wouldn't have wasted money. And also anything grant, don't go and begin to sell property for anything grant. Grant is what you do with minor money, minor amount, minor money that maybe you would have used to buy a recharge card, you can put it in grant. Or you would have used to buy uh, bread, you can put it in grant. They know they sell property, they know they sell car land or whatever for grant. They know they borrow money for, for grant because grant is 50 50. Anything that telling you that calling Ahmed, the Tinubu, that calling CBN is a lie. Nobody knows them. Nobody is going anywhere for you. You better know it. But when somebody says the truth, you will begin to cast against the person. Any evil you want to say, please say it to yourself now. I've given you 
I've given you the message from the Lord. Any insult you want to insult me is coming back to you and your future. Any abuse you want to abuse is coming back to you. Any negative thing you want to say is coming back to you. Please, Nigerians, there is no money anywhere to give to you. We are in the system. We are in, in all the systems. We are there. From federal, from Tinubu presidency, down to the last, the last power in Nigeria, we are there. Our people are there. We know everything that is happening. We have known, we know the reports. This CDHR, our people are there. We know the reports of this. We know the report. We know what we command. And we know what Ken has been doing. He, he and his foot soldiers have been doing to see if they can turn the judgment in Ken upside down. But it's not working. They will bring out exactly what they saw. What we what are, what do they see? They will see emptiness. Everything, all of you, even you can, you know that everything is calm. So why not come out? Come out and own up. Call the CEO for meeting. Tell them, tell them you have tried that it's not working, that there's no money you give to them, that you apologize to them. Then tell them how much is remaining and share it to them. If we can listen to this, we can do well. If not, this journey of the meetup and the movement of um, the press conference people, it, they, they will open your eyes. They will open your eyes. I want to stop here. My conclusion is all grand pressure group tell Nigerians to tell that truth. Stop all these fabricating things. And Ken Wakaman come out and apologize to Nigeria because there's nothing in it. There's nothing in Grand Pressure Group is giving to you. There's no government that they are arranging to give you anything. Every money all of them are talking is still Serita Heroes Life Life Foundation, Lifeline Foundation money. It's still Serita's money. Every money that telling you government did this government is still Serita's money. That's Serita uh, that um, uh, Beatrice Odudu, Heroes uh, Lifeline Foundation, that is still the money that are talking. Every money that are telling you is still that same money. That is the same money. No government is giving them any money. No government is sharing any money. So then, so the truth will set everybody free, especially you, the, the grand pressure groups that Nigerians trusted and are supporting you financially. Tell them the truth and stop hiding them. Stop giving them uh, high, high blood pressure and low uh, blood pressure. Tell them the whole truth. Truth is bitter, but tell it to them. It will repent them. Only in a few days, they will forget about it. Start hiding them when you know that there is nothing. Nigerians, are one, my name is Evangelist Dr. Ambassador Victoria Engozubo. Check my ways since last year that I started talking. It's still the same thing. It is still what is happening. I want to tell you this morning that there's no money anywhere that they are crediting you. Nobody is crediting you anything. The, the results that will come out from the movement of uh, Madame Balogo will, will, will judge it will, before that result will come out. Please, if I were you, I will remove myself from a uh, grand, uh, grand community so that you will not die before your time. If I were you, I will, I will remove my mind from anything grant before the result will come out. Some of you that are living in, 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 in grant platforms, some of you don't do anything again. Every minute you are there at the comments. I want to let you know that the result that will come out will shock. I'm sure the result is already out. Before it comes out, it's already out. And it's shocking. National Windows Forum is everywhere. The result is already out. Before it will come out, it's already out. And it will be shocking. Remove yourself from grand community so that you don't die before your time. Forget anything you have spent. Forget it because it is not life. Your life is more important. So that you'll be able to stand the shock. Forget it before the results will come out. It will be shocking. Many people will drop dead. But that is not our prayer. Thank you and God bless you. I remain the baddest doctor, Ambassador Victoria, and the devil. 
those that have man to talk, you are free to talk. But one of the group that will shock the Nigerians in this in this in the in the fund matter, financial matter, is Widow's Forum. What Widow's Forum will shock people. We don't make noise, but God is doing something. We don't make noise, but God is doing something. If you are a, a if you are a widow in Nigeria and you have not joined National Widows Forum, the Resident Divine Widows Foundation, you are making noise, you are disturbing yourself. Go and register and join now. Any state you are, we have coordinators in all the states. Look for the coordinator of that state and join so that we will have your candidates because God is doing something. Let it reach all the widows in Nigeria. Thank you and God bless you. In the name of Jesus Christ. Happy New Week in Jesus Christ's name. Amen. All Grand Pleasure Group, tell Nigerians the truth. Ken Wakama, tell Nigerians the truth and apologize to Nigerians. Case closed. If you can do this, you will have rest. Because even you people that are lying to Nigerians, you don't have rest. It's better you come and go to it and tell them the truth so that they will have rest. You also will have rest. If you do this, do this, peace will be your portion. In the name of Jesus Christ. Shalom.